Hey, I'm Noah from 9257R, and I'm presenting this device from Ty from 9257C. And it's a bit of a walk down or walk through of his Mogo mech. So you can see his pistons kind of tucked away here. And what that does, it helps with the center of gravity. And it also helps, it's just really easy to access. So the real sauce is really his beautiful ramp right here. It's just one piece of C channel. And you can see when I tilt the bot up, it is touching the ground, so he can't climb like that. And uh, the real magic actually comes with the mobile goal. And you can see when I push it up on here on this little lip, it pops right up. So then if you can, but you can see that if I drive back, it kind of just leaves it behind. So like that, it's kind of, it, it's in its prime state. But if it's back on, and then if you fire the piston, boom. So now you can see I have about an inch, quarter inch of clearance, and that makes it really easy to just drive around, do his thing, but you don't have to worry about it coming out. You can go down, it can go up, and it really doesn't struggle to stay in at all. And it's really safe, because you can see I have two prongs right here. And uh, before I deploy my ring mech, it does work with yellow. So if the piston will let go. You can see right here I have a yellow goal, and it can just go right in there and with that you see i have a lot of I, I still have a lot of clearance it does tilt a little more with yellow <laughs> but it is um it's passive it's <laughs> so as you can see it's active extension and retraction which means there's no rubber bands needed and that's pretty much it it's pretty simple so i recommend you steal this design for it because it's really good so i think you could use this in a tip no, um high stakes so thank you. Goodbye.